Hi, boys and girls. Uh, Today we're going to read a book called Dinos to Go. And this is by Sandra Boynton. And this is Seven Nifty Dinosaurs in One Swell Book. So let's see. There's our contents. Here's everything we're going to read about. Here is Zoomer. There goes Zoomer rocketing past. Whatever she does, she does it fast. A wispy little thing with energy galore, she's a jazzy orange dinosaur. Zoomer loves to play outside. She loves to swing. She loves to slide. She loves to chase the little ball. So much to do, she does it all. She loves to go hop, 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 hop. It's time to rest. Stop, Zoomer. Stop. Are you a Zoomer? Are you like Zoomer? The next dinosaur is Dozy. Dozy, dozy dinosaur sleeps and eats and not much more. Her color is a lazy green with floppy scales of tangerine. See these scales? Kind of a tangerine color. Dozy likes the beach a lot. But sometimes when it gets too hot, she slowly moves into the shade and hopes you'll bring her lemonade. And on her birthday, Dozy might consume the cake in just one bite and maybe eat the candles too, so she won't have to blow or chew. When Dozy has a book that's new, she never gets beyond page two. She'll stare and stare and never stir. Perhaps you'll turn the page for her. So what does dozy, you think that's short for to doze? It means to sleep, to rest, to doze. That's what she's doing on the beach. Our next dinosaur is Hey Ho Howdy. Hey Ho Howdy is a merry fellow. He smiles all day and night. His scales are pink, the rest is yellow, and his teeth are dazzling white. Hey Ho Howdy is always happy. He stands out in a crowd. His dinosaur feet are tap, tap, tappy, and his dinosaur song is loud, very loud. Hey Ho Howdy is a friendly guy. He's perky night and day. And if you're sad, he'll come on by to sing and dance and play. But sometimes you wish he would go away. Are you a Hey Ho Howdy? You're always happy and smiling. That's good. That's a good thing. This dinosaur is called sob. And what does it mean to sob? To cry, yes. Oh dear. Sob, such a sad blue dinosaur. He loves to mope around. He doesn't smile. He doesn't laugh. He sprawls all along the ground. No matter what you do or say to try and make him feel cheerful, he simply sighs and turns away and only gets more tearful. Here are flowers and balloons and chocolate cake. Surprise! Saab looks at them without a word and slowly shuts his eyes. And still he goes on being sad with moans and sidelong glances until there's no one there to see. Then he gets up and dances. He's a trickster. And this dinosaur is called Snort. Snort, a mean red dinosaur, always gets his way. He told me not to tell you more. That's all I have to say. Oh boy, this guy. The next dinosaur we're going to meet is called Tremble. That must be Tremble behind the door, a timid lavender dinosaur. He's afraid of the dark, afraid of the light, afraid that the little bunny might bite, afraid of his shadow, afraid of a cloud, afraid of anything big or loud, afraid of a mouse or a tiny bug, afraid of everything except a hug. 
Oh, that's good. We can give him lots of hugs then, can't we? And this dinosaur, the last one, is called Smooch. What does that mean? Do you know what smooch? To give a kiss. Smooch? Let's see what she's like. Smooch is warm and wonderful. A dinosaur quite pink. She has so very many friends and loves each one, I think. She loves to sing with Howdy. With Sob, she'll sadly sigh. She's kindly comforts Tremble. With Zoomer, she zooms by. She loves to snooze with Dozy upon the beach all day. I think she's even fond of Snort from pretty far away. So Smooch is our dinosaur that gets along with everyone. She makes everyone feel like they're her friend. That's really nice. Okay, until next time. Till we read again. Bye-bye.